Hi guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. Um, as promised uh, for my unboxing video of the Samsung DAX uh, station, I'm going to do a quick setup for you and to show you how it kind of looks. Uh, so here it is, here's the actual DAX. Uh, hopefully you can see it. Uh, it's black, so it's very hard. But uh, this is Samsung DAX the station, okay? And um, <clears throat> here's the in the back here, you'll see that there's a US, USB-C uh, output, it's the power source, and that goes <coughs> obviously there. Okay, to my plug, my outlet. And then I have, this is the HDMI cable. This is the USB 2.0 that goes to um, uh, for the keyboard, okay, and and mouse as well. So uh, as you guys may know, um, I actually have a K a KVM uh, switch. So I'm going to be using that. These cables are basically it's pretty much the exact same setup as you would without a switch, except that uh, I'm just passing it through my switch so that I can switch through multiple. Um, laptops that I have. So in this instance here, uh, I've connected it. But the only thing that's different from what I'll be doing uh, is that because I don't want to use the stock audio of my monitor, uh, I would I and there's no, uh, for example, so you know here's my monitor, but you know it's a Samsung TV, 32 inch TV but I still don't like the stock audio. So, what, and because there's no 3.5 millimeter um, uh, port that goes into my, uh, as you can see here, um, into uh, my switch, so that I can actually use the speakers here, the Logitech speakers, uh, I actually bought a, what's called a, um, well this is the Tron, um, uh, 3.5 millimeter to USB 2.0 um, adapter, and so that will allow me to basically plug in my 3.5 millimeter uh, th millimeter um, cable uh, into my dock. So it uses, you know, obviously the set. There's two USB ports on the decks, as you can see. I'm using one for my keyboard and mouse, but uh, I'm gonna just put this one in here. And what I'll do is I'll stick this in here, and then I will take the green cable, uh, which is my audio cable, and I will put it in there. Uh, pink, for your knowledge, is just basically the mic, but I'm not using the mic, so um, that's the only difference, okay? So just uh, bear with me while I just plug that in. Okay, so I plug that, that, that in, so again, power source, check. HDMI cable check, USB 2.0 for um, mouse and keyboard, uh, and the audio to the adapter, USB 2.0 adapter for audio. Um, just something that I put in so that I can actually use my switch here. All good. So, already plugged in and such. So, I will just turn it this way a bit. And then. Um, just let's see if I can do this with one hand. I'm going to take my S8, S8 Plus rather, and just sit it on the dock. Okay, so what happens is that it goes blank, right? So since I have it on my laptop right now, see, this is I'm just going to switch it to the actual uh, dock which is the, the DEX, rather, station. So, let's see what happens. So, so there you go. Um, this is the, see, so I'll go back a bit. You can see that um, my 32-inch monitor is basically uh, sending, providing the desktop experience that it promises on the DEX, with the DEX uh, station. So let me see if I can try to 
do a couple of things here. So here is the Excel app, so that's great. Okay, so just move, you can move it around, so on and so forth. You can resize it as advertised in the during the launch. You can pull up Word and pretty much do the same thing, right? Resize it. You can do copy and paste as well, right? Um, I'll bring up the news. This is my BBC app, okay? And I can, you know, try to make it smaller, okay? Um, this is the website. I was looking for a good. Um, uh, desk mount. Uh, trip light was good, but uh, I found a better one. Uh, so, and in any case, so you can see, um, you know, along the horizontal, you get to see your file, you hit the internet, email, um, the gallery, you get your settings up, <coughs> and along here you have. All your apps and you can click here and it actually shows all your apps okay um, and if you open the apps and they're in use it basically the icons show up uh, a lot on the bottom as, as such um, and here um, zoom in here this is just basically your status you know, your battery status, your connection, today is April 24th, so on and so forth. So, you know, I haven't really played much with it because I only received the dock um, today, but um, you can see that it does what it's supposed to do. Um, let me try to play a quick clip in the files here, just for uh, like some apps don't work, like VLLC is not working right now, so I'll close that, but for example, I will go to YouTube. And maybe just play, I won't play the, I won't play the, all the songs, but all of the song because of copyright, but I just wanted to show you, uh, Do you want the to speaker. The global financial market so I'm using these speakers, right? Where? Get trading two on two on your mobile device. So I'll skip time. this. there so it's playing right so I just wanted to quickly show that um, I didn't want to play too much of it because of copyrights so in any case I um, uh, hope you like this quick review uh, or setup uh, what I will do is I will do a comparison with my actually smart dock the Note 2 smart dock which attempts to do the same thing but I'll do a review of it and uh, my um, and the actual uh, the deck station itself. Okay, so again, uh, here it is mirrored on my 32 inch Samsung TV. And uh, what I can do is just you know, with my switch, I'm just gonna switch back to my uh, laptop, which is underneath here, and which is kind of neat. I like my switch, and if I just switch back to the decks, yeah, there it is. Yeah. Alright guys, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to my channel. Thanks very much and uh, see you next time.